Life in the UK exam preparation from Sunrise Training and Exam Support Centre Croydon. For full course, you can contact us on 07 422-405-866. Please note, calls from Hidden ID will not go through. So you can send us a text with your name and request and we will get back to you. In today's lesson, we are talking about King James the First. Yes, King James the first of England, Wales, and Ireland. And he was King James the sixth of Scotland. I know, it's not easy. So many names, so many titles to remember. Let me make it very easy for you. Just remember King James is the same person, same king with two different titles. In Scotland, he was known as King James the sixth of Scotland. But when he became King of England, Wales and Ireland, he got title of King James the first of England, Wales and Ireland. King James the first. During my discussion, I will be using just this title, King James the first. King James I was son of Mary, Queen of Scots. Mary, Queen of Scots, was devout Catholic, but son James I was strongly Protestant. King James I ordered to translate Bible into English, but remember, this was not the first translation of Bible into English. This was a new translation of Bible into English. So remember in your exam, do not get confused. If they give you a statement, you need to choose true and false very carefully. If they are asking you, King James the first Bible was first translation, you have to choose statement false. It was a new translation of Bible into English, not the first translation. And King James Bible is known as authorized version. It is still in use in the Protestant churches. Next question that we need to know about King James the first is, why do we celebrate Bonfire Night? Every year we celebrate Bonfire Night, but did you ever think about it? Why do we celebrate it? There is an event that happened on 5th of November, 1605, when a group of Catholics led by Guy Fawkes wanted to blow up the houses of the parliament. They made a plan to use gunpowder to blow up the houses of the parliament and the plan was to blow it up on 5th of November 1605 but the plan failed and Guy Fawkes was arrested he was caught red-handed he was executed and all his fellows were executed too so these are the important points we need to remember about King James the first after King James I, his son was his heir, Charles I. Both father and son were less skilled politically. Both father and son believed in the divine rights of kings, means king was directly appointed by God. So keep revising, keep uh, watching the videos, and good luck for your exam.